Hello everybody, this is the joke of the week, brought to you by Straight to the Money by Detrick Bennett, CEO of Freedom Investors. Today's topic will be on the reason blacks are the poorest ethnic group in America. But here goes the joke of the week. There was this 92 year old man went to his doctor for his annual checkup. Before leaving the office, the doctor gave him strict instructions on what he needed to do to better his health. So about a couple of weeks later, the doctor was walking through the park you see the old man over there with this young, fine, hot woman rolling around in the grass. So he walked over there. He said, uh, sir, I, I'm glad to see you doing all right. The old man raised up and looked at the doctor and said, yeah, I took your advice. The doctor looked puzzled. He was like, what advice was that? He said, doctor, you told me before I left your office that I need to go find me a hot mama and be careful. The doctor said, no, 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 sir. I told you you have a heart murmur and you need to be careful. And that's your joke of the week. Hello, if you like your credit repair or you want life insurance, I would like to own your own business, be a credit repair agent or a life insurance agent. At the end of this video, in the description, I'll leave the info where you can go online and do that. First, I want to start out by saying I'm not a professional, but I did get my doctoral degree from Hard Knocks of Life University. Today's topic is going to be on the reason blacks are the poorest ethnic group in America. I try to put out these videos once a week. Try to do it on Sundays. If you like the info I'm putting out, please hit the subscribe button at the bottom, the bell sign, and the like button. By all means, share it with a friend. I was doing some research and I ran across this info. It said blacks were the poorest ethnic group in America. What causes this wealth gap with these different reasons? One, financial literacy. Blacks we were never taught how to handle our finances. Two, ownership. Most blacks don't own a home or any real estate or their business. Number three with passive income. We haven't been taught the knowledge of having money and make money for us. Passive income is where your money can make money while you sleep. Research showed me that if blacks and Hispanics own real estate like the whites, the racial wealth gap will narrow about 33%. 72% of whites own their home and properties. 43% of blacks own their home. The net worth of homeowners is $195,400. As a tenant or a rental, it's $5,400. Medium net worth across the blacks is $7,113. And for Hispanics, it's $8,348. And whites is $111,146. Financial literacy classes, they're being taught in white school and private school. But public schools, there's no classes taught about financial literacy. So everyone should teach their kids, loved ones, friends about their finances. If we can do this, we can come back financial literacy. Thank you and have a nice day.